Well, chants of Longhorn Pride and Burnt Orange filled the main mall and the drag tonight. The annual Texas OU Torchlight Parade and Rally just wrapped up, and KXAN's Doug Shoup is live out at UT. Doug, what was the turnout like out there tonight? Well, Robert and Leslie, organizers estimate more than a thousand people attend this event every year, and the main mall was packed, as it always has been in years past. And all of them tonight are ready for this weekend's game. Before a game as big as Texas OU, there's a Texas-sized pep rally at UT. It's awesome. I mean, that's why you go to school here. You don't get this anywhere else. The first torchlight parade and rally began in 1916 before the Thanksgiving Texas A&M game. Texas won that year, and the parade was a tradition through the late 60s. After a 20-year hiatus, Texas X's resumed the tradition in 1987. It's important to keep this going, not only just for the spirit of it, but for the tradition, and keep everybody excited about football and about UT in general. Various Student groups take part each year, and fans pack the main mall to show support for Coach Mac Brown and his players. There's not too many events on campus that all the different organizations come together for. And on this night, all Longhorn fans are focused on the future, not on looking back at the past. I think we're excited. Yeah, we had a rough time last weekend, but we're ready for some revenge, and um, I think people aren't expecting us to do well, so that's even more drive for those boys. I mean, we're all pumped up. We did lose last week, but we're ready for this week, ready to win. And Coach Mac Brown reminded all of the fans heading to Dallas this weekend to drive safe and responsibly. Reporting live at UT tonight, Doug Shoup, KXA and Austin News.